Uh, hello, good day, I'm Oliver. So now we will see if your model, you already lost all the settings from your radio and you don't know how to set up and it is too complicated for me to explain from the phone. So I can do like this, I set up my radio and uh, same settings, I can send you the document you upload to your radio and uh, activate it directly to control your model. But to do like this, your receiver or plugs should be same position as original factory plug position. Means same plugs position as my radio and the receiver position. So we can transfer directly to use the program, to use the model settings. So let's see. Come to here. So I got this Fly, Fly Sky Assistant. So this one, it is an installation package. First, you will need to install this Fly Sky Assistant to your computer. I will send this one to you, Fly Sky Assistant installation package. You install it. After you open, it will be like this one, Fly Sky Assistant. So double click, open, then will be like this. You will need internet internet to load in this wire. Maybe if your internet is good, maybe 10 minutes, a few minutes can load in, open it. So after open, it is this page. And from your radio, you will have original USB plug. Plug it in to your computer. Your radio power on, then plug in. Because here you see no device detected. Plug in will be detected. Original USB wires, yeah, but because if you use other USB wires, maybe it cannot transfer all the signal to your computer. So now it is connected. Online device settings. So this radio, it is a EV light, Paladin EV light. So now let's do, for example, one of our customer lost his radio all the settings with the Lisu backhole actuator and the loader, that one, the backhole. So let's see how to upload the model settings to his radio and uh, directly control. So let's see, this one now already online, click. After click the page, click the radio, you will see here have update, export, import. So now we will click, for me, my side, I will click export. Load, because I have to send my the file of model setting to you, for example. So load TX model. So here you see how all this already have the settings in my radio. So here it is for uploading my model settings to the computer, but I have already uploaded. So it is here, this one, Lisu A0010, that's the backhaul model settings. And uh, so I will show you again how to upload to the computer. Let's say I will upload, export this FlySky02, choose it, and here, click export. And then you will put these settings on the computer table, yeah? So choose your file. Put on the table, you can see clearly. So I will save. Now it's saving. Okay, so now it is already upload the model setting to my table. Model file exported successfully. So okay. Okay, so I already update uploading the model settings to my table, that's this one just uh, uploading here. But it, that's just for example. So for the backhaul, it is this file. Now, uh, after I send this file to you, you will have to import it to your radio. Let's see how to import this one. Lisu A0010 backhaul file. Okay, let's see how to import. So after you receive this file, go to import. Load model file. Click and uh, go to your computer table, choose the file I sent to you. So here, this one, the backhole file, choose it and open it. 
So now you have this one. And click it to choose it. One minute. Only this one. Load model file. Import. So choose import. Now it is already here. The file is already here. Choose import. Click. So now it is connected to my radio. And I have the new model settings for backhaul. After you receive, same procedure, you how you import to your radio. So choose this one and uh, add, add to your radio. Add. So, but position, I will choose this one. Yeah, I put to model two. Your radio for models, you can connect to different many, uh, like 18 models. Now model two, it is available, so you choose Model 2, also for your radio, if you want to put into another model, you can choose another one, like a 7, 8, 9. So now I will put it to model number 2. So, OK, continue. So you see, now it is showing import successfully. Click OK. So after import successfully, click OK, now come to your radio. So during all this operation, you, you're not operating your radio, yeah? And the USB plug, no touching. Keep it, leave it like that. So now power it on, check. Is it successful? Go to modules. We change it. Yeah, A0010, it's already loading to module number three. I click number two, maybe I jumped. So successfully, Import it to number three, model three. So let's change to it to see the settings. Already switched to model three. Okay, let's go out to see the function assign. If we correctly have all the switch control. Yeah, correct, because for backhaul, we have 17 channel in using. Yeah, coming to 17 channel. And check it out, we can switch from forward control to back control. Now it is forward control. After switch to back control, you see the switch and function change. So we already successfully imported with the backhaul operating settings. Also you can check from the display servos. Yeah, that's all the settings here. Good, and start the pump. Start the pump. Yeah, okay, all good. Okay, so model already upload, so disconnect USB. Okay, so you can close it or finish. You can operate. So your radio now has a new the operating system as original, but you have to bind it again with your receiver. After binding again, you can operate directly. So as I said in the beginning, you have to do like this on the condition that your receiver or plugs, it is at original position as factory settings here. So it is the same settings with my radio. Thank you. Bye-bye.